Good morning everyone, how are you all doing? Hope your fast is going well if you're fasting. So, today's a funny one. <laughs> it's actually not funny at all. I'm very sleep deprived, okay, because, hear this, this is a story. I woke up for suhoor at 3.30 a.m. because I went to sleep at 1.30. <laughs> and then, after I had my suhoor and everything, prayed my fajr. How could I not fall asleep until 6 a.m.? And then 6.10, my son comes into the room and he's like, I'm hungry. <laughs> Tried to send him back, it didn't work. It didn't, I don't know why I thought it would. But then I just laid there after he went downstairs thinking, today's the day that Tesco is supposed to restock my little express one. And I've been wanting to get yeast and plain flour for the longest time. It's been weeks, okay, weeks. And I don't know what's going on. People have stopped buying toilet paper and are now buying all the yeast, the flour, the shop stocks. So I was like, get up. It's been ages since I last actually got up that early. Guys, listen, six o'clock, haven't even slept. I'm gonna be very surprised if I don't take a nap today. But I'm gonna try my hardest not to. So I went to Tesco Express, took a walk there. It was so quiet outside. There was no cars, no humans. Perfect idea. For a walk for me don't like people i'm pretty sure they don't like me too but i'm fine with that that's how i like it <laughs> um the birds were chirping and it was just sunny beautiful day nope there was no flour there was no yeast and then i went to the big tesco i found self-raising flowers better than nothing yeah you gotta take what you get but no yeast so i'm gonna order that online on amazon hopefully hopefully it's not crazy expensive but I bought a bunch of stuff that I didn't even intend to buy. Most of it baking, because obviously I'm fasting, I'm hungry. I'm going to show you guys a haul. Everything is in the kitchen right now, and it's like a sauna in the kitchen. So I'm not going to do that. Liana's still sleeping in the next room, and my husband's sleeping too. Thought I'd give him a lie. It's usually me sleeping till 12 a.m. 12 a.m., 12 p.m. And Malik even said, Mommy, it's you that's usually the lazy one, and that sleeps still late. I can't even be mad at him because he's speaking facts. <laughs> I'm not even ashamed. I'm not. I love my beauty sleep and so should you. Everyone should love sleep. When Liana wakes up, we're going to just feed her and chill. But for now, I'm going to close my laptop. I did some age shopping. Yep, it has started. I bought something for Malik, for Liana, so they're all ticked off. My husband's also doing the same for those two, so I don't need to go crazy. And now I just have... So I bought for two, I have eight people to buy for now. How fantastic is that? I didn't upload yesterday, no. I did film though, but it's a brand video that's gonna go up next Thursday, hopefully. Um, so it needs to be approved, etc. But it's a very exciting one. It's very much related to food, so I can't wait for you guys to see that. <laughs> but that's it, I've got nothing else to say. I'm gonna carry on with my lead shopping. Um, have you guys started age shopping? Let me know and let me know what you guys are buying for your loved ones or what you want most importantly tell me what you want for a lead so that I have some ideas on um, what to tell my husband that I want. So far I want AirPods. Yeah because I take a lot of long walks and it's always very quiet walks and it's very boring. But let me know what you guys want to get for a lead so I can have ideas for other people like sisters, brothers etc. But yeah, catch you guys in a bit because I'm tired of holding this. I'm tired. I'm tired. Okay, I'm just tired in general. So Liana is awake, and the first thing that she does is uh, try to snatch whatever Malik has. <laughs> yep. Anyway, she woke up um, maybe 10, 15 minutes ago. I got her nappy changed, got her dressed, I got her food ready. She's gonna be having a ready breakfast. Huh? What is it? Hada. Hada. Do you guys know what Hada is? Mali, do you know what Hada is? Yep, Hannah. Hannah. She loves watching Oma and Hannah. Can we to put Oma and Hannah? Yes or no? Uh. No. <laughs> <laughs> Let's <laughs> go. 
I can't cope with this girl. Can you cope with this? I really cannot cope with this girl. Leanne, are you okay, Hon? Are you comfy? Oh, this is her favorite part. This is your favorite part, isn't it? You only got up from him because this is your favorite part. Oh. Oh, okay. Whoa, yay. Look who came upstairs to disturb me. I was just saying to my husband that whenever I put the camera on and she sees that it's on, she's behaving 10-10. Yes. Baby. Is there a baby? Yeah, so they came to disturb me whilst I run away. <laughs> Come. I've got baby for you. 10 years guarantee at least. Ba, 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 ba. You just don't try the first time for now. Up to you. Sleep. How is she singing? Ba oh, oh, that's right. Uh -uh. Don't touch my lens. Yay, you cutie. You cutie for tutti. You cutie. You cutie. Come here. I've just finished editing that video that I was talking about that I need to send off tomorrow. Not tomorrow, tomorrow Sunday. On one day. So that's done out of the way. I wanted to change my bed sheets because it's Saturday already. Honestly, these days are going so quickly. It feels like just yesterday or two days ago that I changed my bedding and now I have to do it again. What? I cannot think of anything worse than having to change bed sheets when you're fasting because that in itself alone is a workout. I'll probably do it later. But one thing that I have been wanting to do and have been putting it off for the longest time is cleaning the fridge out. I used to be very on top of it and I used to clean out this fridge before I did my food shopping every single week. And then somehow amidst all of that, lockdown happened. So I've just let it loose for the past seven weeks. <laughs> and it really needs doing because I need to see the food that's in the fridge. Sometimes things get lost in there and I find it like weeks later and it's gone off and I'm really not happy about the food wastage. One thing that I cannot stand and my husband too. He's um, passed this over onto me, which is really good, is wasting food. I can't bear the thought of my hand throwing food away. Even if it is for recycling, it doesn't matter. Like, we shouldn't be wasting food. No, no, no. That's a no-no. So, I need to see what's in my fridge. And by cleaning it out, it means everything is nice and neat. And I can see the food and eat it. Picked this jar up. I want to put my breadcrumbs in here. Because I bought a bunch of breadcrumbs. And then I got this sandwich tin. I don't know why I just picked up the one. Actually, I know why. There was only one left. We have two of these fresh egg lasagna sheets. I always, always buy these nowadays as opposed to the hard shell ones. These are so much tastier and they cook a lot quicker. And you can like mold it into whatever dish that you have by just cutting it with scissors. Game changer since I've tried them. I told you guys I found self-raising flour. I bought two because I'm not planning to try and hunt down flour anymore. And my husband was just telling me that the difference between normal plain flour and self-raising flour is that self-raising flour has like some sort of baking soda in it. So you don't need to add that. I don't know. And then I picked up two of these storage wide things for my living room for the kids tour. Now into the tiny Tesco, the Express, I picked this up. And uh, these are the pasta and sauce, cheese and broccoli. And the only reason I picked it up is because I've been looking for the mac and cheese macaroni and I could not find them anywhere. I've been looking for weeks now. So if you can see, this is basically the, the mac and cheese pasta. So I thought I'd just use that for it and make my own sauce. We have some chives because this is one of the ingredients for the mac and cheese fry balls that we're gonna make today. Greasy honey, that's the size of my head. I picked up this mac and cheese, it looks really good. I have just gone ahead and done this really quickly guys because 
I wanted to get it over and done with and get started with iftar slash dinner early. So there we go. We have the dairy, the cheeses, we have the butters, we have the fruit section here and then um, meat, fishes and then we have the just random things there and then we have bits and bobs of condiments and then in here where the eggs would usually be i've just got like medicine for the kids and then we've got the sauces there and we have the milk and juices simple done You should have seen the tantrums this one through to get that jelly. Is it nice? Going all over your clouds? Is it nice? Is it nice, Liana? Wow. Wow. <laughs> Come, Papa, help. She wants her spoon back. <laughs> I was gonna help you. Feed. She has no chill. I'm, 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 I'm not taking it from me. She said that's my spoon. I'm not even getting anything in. I help you? I help you? I help I feed you? Oh. I feed you? Papa help? <laughs> I can't deal with her sassy behavior. Feed you? Help you? Oh, she's done it. She's gonna look at the deal herself. Mm, yum. This is what happens when you wake up at 5.45. Yeah. He's eating. Yep. Yeah. I give you my phone, Malik? Yeah. Huh? It's charged now. Yeah. I'll give you my phone, Malik? How sweet is she, though? <laughs> she's just covering him up. Yeah. Liana, wake him up. Malik. It's currently five o'clock and I'm gonna start iftar early because I want the kids to have what I'm making for dinner. I'm making uh, stir fry noodles with sweet and sour chicken and what else am I gonna make? Oh yeah, I'm also making the macaroni and cheese fried ball. I was just initially gonna make the fried cheese balls and um, call it quits. I know and then I realized that you can't have that as an actual meal. Oh my god, is my fridge open? I just realized that from looking at the viewfinder. Wow. How good does this mac and cheese look? I've just topped it up with some chives and my gosh it smells so good. I'm gonna pop it in here now. Mama! Yes? Did dad eat all the chicken today? Yes. No. So hubby has taken the kids upstairs to give them a bath and put them to bed. These are the noodles that I have just put in there and that's boiling away and then look at this beauty right here beautifully golden i was gonna add a broccoli but my husband's not keen he's like don't add broccoli so i'm not gonna do that we just have um mushrooms and red pepper in here that's all i had left of the pepper i didn't have any green peppers or anything like that so yeah it smells absolutely divine it looks so little because this pan is so massive so this is my hand right so the pan is absolutely huge um, but right now I'm about to add in some of this oyster sauce and I'm also about to add some soy sauce. I was going to add this one but this one's not finished so I'm going to get rid of this. I think there's not that much left really. I don't need a lot so that's enough soy sauce and a little bit of the oyster sauce. 
There we go, that's enough. And I'm also going to add a little bit of black pepper. If there's leftovers, Liana really, really loves, loves noodles. So all you do is just make lines. You cut it up in squares. You just roll it around into a small ball. This is what you want to be left with. I'm going to do that with all of them. So once they look like that, they go back in the freezer. I'm using Liana's plate. So here is my chicken thighs that I cut as much fat off as possible. Cut into small pieces and I'm going to season it with black pepper, soy sauce, vinegar, salt. And I'm also going to add cornstarch or corn flour, same thing. So we are making the breadcrumb for the mac and cheese fried balls. So we've got some flour there and we're going to add some of this breadcrumbs, panko breadcrumbs. And in here he's got one egg and half a cup of milk. But anyway, still frying chickens in for its second batch of frying guys. So we're double frying. And here I've just got some onion sliced up and a little bit of oil. I'm going to add in my frozen peppers. I don't have any more fresh peppers, so this will have to do. Let that cook for a little bit. And then I'm going to add in some chopped pineapple and my salt. So that's done. Can you see the difference in colour as well? So I added in pineapple. Then add in a bit of chili flakes. The sweet and sour sauce. You can't do it. We're going to mix that up and it's going to coat the chicken with a lovely sauce and that's that done. Now we're going to move on to this bad boy here. Look at this please. Did you think I was like stupid or something? No, it's not. Don't, I cannot even deal. Just want to stuff my face right now. It's You're so fasting. good. I know I'm fasting, clever clogs. That's it. Some of that. Come on. A tiny bit more of that. No, that's too much. Yeah. That's enough, yeah. That's it. Thank you very much. It feels like we're at a like, Chinese restaurant, ah, isn't it? Time to. Dig in. We broke our fast, then we prayed, and I thought I would actually try out the mac and cheese deep fried balls on camera. Bear in mind, we made these and then we went to pray, so they're still warm but not very, very hot. But they made the three was too much as a start. Hmm? And the three of them was too much mm. as a start, and yeah. Best thing I've tried all week. So good. We are so stuffed. Alhamdulillah. That mac and cheese balls though. Mmm, so good. Honestly. I don't want to say about them. I could happily eat like thousands of those. Become the size of a house and live happily ever after. <laughs> But I just wanted to come on and end this vlog here. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Leave me a comment down below letting me know whether you'd like to see more videos like this with the recipes. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'm going to go now. I'm going to sleep. I didn't have a nap today. And I've been standing up all day. And the winning point is that I didn't get a migraine. Win-win, alhamdulillah. So anyway, I'm going to go have a nice early night says me the night owl um but i'll catch you guys tomorrow take care bye